Hey guys, Takisugi here. Gonna be doing another game here today on Steam. This is called 50 Years. So, uh, this is another turn-based strategy kind of game. Apparently, you can finish this one quickly. Um, but yeah, we'll give it a whirl here. I haven't actually played it yet. So, let's see. Easy. Uh, blah, blah, blah. I kind of want to do easy. Let's do normal. Extra 100 gold per turn to be American? Haha, <laughs> that sounds good. What, can I not choose any other ones? Um, next. Oh, okay. Here we go. British. Each forester hut gives 10 wood and 10 faith per year. Remember Mill's penalty. How, wait a minute. Should I do a tutorial? Greeks. Greeks look cool. Start a game with the Minotaur's maze. Can hire Minotaurs for food. Big Hydra splits into three mini Hydras. Russians sell fur so they don't build lumber mills. Forester's hut gives 100 gold per turn. Random unit in the army gets an ability to deal double damage. Japanese, wow. You're pretty good military, huh? French, wounded units retreat. I like the artwork that they put into this. Uh, Celts, uh, additional 30 faith per year. Effects last until deforestation begins. Forces of nature, hills, warriors, 15 life. 15 life. Romans, can hire human units for the points of faith. Can't hire mythological creatures. Byzantines. Uh, after acquiring the first point towards a belief, a second belief is immediately granted for free. This sounds like civilization, kind of. Maybe it's like a turn-based kind of simpler, simplified version of civilization. Um, Byzantines. Egyptian. Wow, they got a lot of variety. I like this amount of variety. Struck buildings using faith points. 100 gold per turn. Hmm. I do like to be American. Let's be American. So... Ah, uh, okay, what, menu, okay, yeah, this is kind of a simplistic kind of looking game. Uh, construct a building, barracks, allow swordsmen to be hired, peasants to be hired, peasants to mine gold. I already got one of those, right? Apparently, scouting, I don't think scouting is necessary, yeah, we better get the, uh, better get a swordsman first. Just to have a little bit of defense. You know, America is about, uh, you know, a big defense, big military budget. We can hire an extra peasant as well, but I think we better... 100 gold per year, huh? Yeah, let's go ahead and hire the peasant. So we'll get a little bit of, uh, you know, money generated, and then we can get more swordsmen over time. In the year, huh? Can't scout? How do you scout? I don't know. Struck the building. Can't afford anything else, can I? Monastery is required. Minotaur's maze. You can actually build that as an American. Enchanted forest. Shooting ground. Ah! Okay. Stable. I can't, fire, I can't afford a shooting ground. Hmm. What, what would America do here? What would America do in this case? I think the shooting ground would be an obvious thing. Hmm. I don't really care about the swordsman, do I? Let's get the shooting ground. Oh, 100 wood. Ah, I thought that I said 100 gold. Chicken farm might be good, too. Alright, in the air. You are attacked. Attackers list militia man. Oh, my swordsman is going, is going to ruin him. Send a peasant to that. Alright, just fight, dude. I like the music, too. There you go, bro. Good job. Ten faith points. Enemy lost his militia, man. Alright, so now we got 400 gold this year. Um, Don't have enough for another swordsman. Construct a building. 50 gold per year. 300 gold. Food plus one. I guess we do need some food. We got three out of five foods. Uh, why wouldn't the chicken farm? Oh, it does do the food. Never mind. Blech. Church. 50 faith. Man, my faith is weak. My faith is weak, bro. Church. Gotta have the church for the monastery. Paladins. Paladins sound cool. Cathedral. Knights. Exorcists are taken from the knights. Training costs faith. I don't care about the minotaurs. 
Nice to get hired for the stable. Lumber mill. We definitely need this, I think. 20 wood each peasant. I think the lumber mill would be important so we can build some archers. Definitely, definitely. 50 gold a year, though. That would be useful. We, we need to hire more peasants, actually. Yeah, we need to hire our maximum amount of peasants before we worry about the other stuff. Because this is a lot more gold. We'll build the next place next time. Is this guy still healthy? I don't know. End the year. Wow, no, no attacks that year, so good. Alright. So we got 400. Tell you what, we're, well, we got plenty of food, so forget that. Alright, we'll hire another peasant. End the year. Simple enough. We still got plenty of food. Hire more peasants. Not enough food. Build more. Oh, we capped. Oh, this is like Warcraft. We capped out our food. All right. So let's build. Um. Where is that place I was thinking about? It build. It was gold and foresters. That's it. Fifty gold and one food. Okay. We can't quite get the peasant yet. So I'll end this year. I'm thinking about another swordsman. We gotta think about defense. We gotta think progressively. So there we go. We got two swordsmen on. Yep, see, that's why we hired it. It's a fight. They got this. Easy. Easy. Okay. Alright, so let's get another peasant on. We, we, we got no food, so... I think we should do another forester hut times two. Seems like the reasonable thing to do. And we'll end the year there. Actually, how do we scout? Oh, this is like the timeline we've got going on, huh? Okay, so every time we end the year, we scout more, I guess. Um, let's go ahead and do another swordsman. We also will do another Forester's Hut. Actually, that costs 400 now, huh? Hey, it's actually growing up a little bit, huh? <laughs> this game's kind of fun. Hmm. Can I build nothing else? 500. 100. 100 wood. Definitely can't do much at the moment. Uh oh, oh, the big guy here. Let's see what he does. He's just another swordsman. Let's just fight. Should be easy. See, he, like, my teammate or my my swordsman there. He just one v one the guy, no problem. Scouts has discovered the chicken devil's altar. Scouting. What's that supposed to deal with the chicken devil? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's hire another swordsman. Uh, build more farms. Darn. Um, I'll tell you what, let's just build a chicken farm. Mm. Alright, I can't afford that last guy. Okay. Uh oh. Fight. We gotta deal with the chicken man. Don't die. Alright, good job. Top tier swordsman. Hire new, new swordsman. Darn it, I got more farms again? Holy crap, these guys eat a lot. I do like these things, so. That wouldn't afford me enough. Let's build this. Another peasant as well. Okay, next year we'll go with the chicken devil. Fight! Haha! -ha. Look at all the faith I'm gaining. Den was found. Poor pushers camp. We gotta deal with the chicken devil first. Alright, good swordsman. Darn it! Arr, that's frustrating me. Okay. Okay, times five on that. See, I keep hiring peasants. That's my problem. I think we can hire another one. Then we'll have enough money next year, hopefully. Good. I think we do. And we don't have enough food. <laughs> All right. Chicken. Perfect. That, that lined up perfect. I didn't even have to look. All right, let's deal with this chicken devil. Wait, wait a minute. Chicken Devil will give you a troll's transformation, but he will take your soul in exchange. 
All units in the enemy's army turn to zombie chickens. Scroll can be used once. Deal killing. Chicken Devil will kill a random enemy unit before each battle starts. But the devil will take your soul later. Banish the devil. Get out of here, devil. Alright, so there's four archers here. That doesn't sound good for me, though. Free Forester's Hut. Do I risk it? I'm gonna risk it. These guys might end up killing me, though. Life 30, life 15. Alright, let's try it. Use those shields. Okay, well, that's fine. Perfect. That was easy. Easy peasy. Alright, so we dealt with the poacher camp. So let's go ahead and go back. Can't hire anymore. We got plenty of food to work with now. Um, I don't know what we should work on next. I'm thinking we want some lumber for archers, but the swordsman seems so good. Druids to be hired. One druid. I don't want druids. I don't want the mythology stuff either. That's kind of weak. Um, Sky City. Oh, one angel. Angels. Come on now. Barracks. Town halls. Chicken farms. I mean, if you gotta have exorcist to exor excise demons, though. Paladins can heal. Knights. Knights are kind of cool. Shooting ground. Uh, maybe we'll do a um, archer's thing. I don't know, man. I don't know. I'm fine with the swordsman, actually. I'm kind of frustrated that we're not, like, you know, modernized. Like, with guns and stuff at the moment. In the year. Oh, here we go. Hey, hey. Just as I was saying that, right? Pantheon of the Fat Chickens. At the beginning of the battle, two random units in the army get 20 plus to life. I think now the fat chickens are required. Each chicken farm, support additional peasant, zombie chickens. <laughs> this game likes chickens. Uh, chicken devil. Fallen chickens revive with 50% chance. Chicken devils can be summoned using zombie chickens. Wow. Alright, what is this? Legend of Miners. This is like uh, extra gold for peasants, right? Military, forest, lumberjack masters. I don't care about the forest. Temple of Defender, two swordsmen joining the army immediately. Militiamen have five more life. Angel, appeal, wait, appeal, not angel. Swordsmen is reduced by 200 gold. If you lose the battle, half the peasants automatically go into the militia and appear on the battlefield. Blessing, swordsmen, knights always do maximum damage. Paladin joins the army. Minotaurs and Hydras, eh. Quality Church, last two killed units are revived. Quality Church is required. Five peasants can be hired without town halls. Chicken farm appears for free. Worship, healing units. So let's, let's stick with the sword here. Temple of Defenders. Perfect. We got like two extra swordsmen, like no problem. Um, we got to cap out our um, peasants though. Cap those out real quick. Everything else is really expensive at the moment. Alright, end of the year. Uh oh. Oh, we got a lot of stuff here. Fight. Look at all my swordsmen, though. I got a ton of swordsmen. Oh, phew. No one died. Wait, wait. Oh, no. No one died. Phew. Alright. Let's go hire another peasant. Not enough food. Construct a building. Spell the forester's hut again. All right, now we're capped on peasants. Do need more town halls. We do need more food, though, so let's uh, build a chicken farm. That's all we can afford anyway. In the year. All right, so now we got to make a... Um, are we going to make more swordsmen? We're going to focus on defense, right? Definitely got to get more defense going. We'll hire another swordsman. That should be good. Construct a building. I'm thinking we're going to have to upgrade soon. Be beyond um, swordsman. 100 faith. This is all about faith, though. 
I mean, maybe when I get closer to max faith, I'll do those. Actually, I tell you what, let's build a church. Just, just to generate a little bit of faith. And then we'll uh, be okay with that kind of thing. Let's get that next swordsman in. Uh, whoa, wait, wait, did I build the church already? I can't remember. Yeah, I did. I built, I built one church. So once that faith gets up, I am going to, I think, um, get some paladins going. How much do paladins cost, though? Oh, their training costs take faith. So I'll, I'll get that as a currency as well. And then I guess I'll gradually build up my army with food and whatnot. And that'll be nice. Probably should generate more gold. Oh, crap. Oh, boy. What was all this? Archer. Okay. Hopefully we can win this fight. I'm a little bit one-dimensional, to be honest. Looks like, um... Oh, no. One's gonna die. Okay, we lost one swordsman. Darn. So maybe archers are kind of useful with my uh, swordsman. Alright, so we gotta hire another swordsman, of course. Uh, whoa, that costs a lot of money. I'll tell you what, let's build another town hall. We need a lot more money. Now, this should be an easy fight here. Bang, bang, boom. Uh oh, hey, yay, we leveled up. Cost of swordsman is reduced by 100 gold. If you lose a battle, half the peasants. But, uh. Peasants mine 10% more gold. 500 gold at once. Hmm. Generating gold would be pretty useful, but 100 gold less for a swordsman. That would be very useful as well. Let's just go down the line here. We need to get down this line. Swordsman and knights. Once we get to this point about the minotaurs and whatnot, we're going to... Just screw that. Uh, you know what I mean? Alright. So, swordsmen are a little cheaper now. Okay, so if we can hire two peasants, then we gotta build a chicken farm. Or a forester's hut. Yeah, we got enough for a hut. Perfect. I'm thinking those huts aren't that great anymore. <laughs> like maybe you should just go hard or go home. I don't know. It might add up over time. It might add up. Alright, end the year. No attacks, yay. Year 18. We're getting up there. Haven't really gotten anywhere right here. Alright, so we can hire one peasant. Does anything else create... Okay, cow shed gets more food. Stable. Nice to be hired. Three knights. Hmm. How how do, how have we lost so much faith exactly? I don't understand. I thought my faith was really up there. Is it because someone died? I don't really get it. All right, build a chicken farm. Need more gold. I think that's all I can do this year. There we go. There we go more peasants. Another chicken coop. Get one more peasant in. Uh-oh. Ooh, this is getting pretty risque. It's quite a few now. Oh, man, we've lost at least two there. Oh, my gosh. Are we going to lose this? Oh, my gosh. We lost so much. Lost four of them. I think we need archers. Okay. We got a lot of faith built up, though. So let's get that monastery out next round. We need to save, save the money a little bit. Well, we can hire a few peasants with the food we just expenditured in the year. Oh, crap. I forgot get, about getting attacked another year. Oh, crap. They got a knight, too. Oh, no. This is bad. This is bad. He's going to lose bad, too, I think. Oh, no. Go, militias. Oh, good. They didn't die. Phew. Oh, man, that sucks. Din was found. Yeah, screw that. I can't go to any of those because I got no army. <laughs> All right, let's get this monastery. Hire a knight is required. Oh, my gosh. If I get attacked this time, I'm so dead. Please don't attack. Please don't attack. Actually, I oh, can't hire anything. Whew. Swordsmen and knights always do maximum damage. 
That sounds good. We got one paladin right away from that. Why do we need... I guess it's because you got to upgrade your knights, right? So what do I need? Now allows knights to be hired. 800. One knight, two paladin. Need more faith. Darn it. Did it use my faith when I did that? That's whack. Okay. Can hire another swordsman. Oh, please don't get attacked. Darn it. I got attacked. Well, at least we got a paladin and a knight. I think they might be able to handle this. We'll see. Yeah, Paladin's doing work, man. He's healing himself and dealing with these... Oh, jeez, he's dead. All right, Knight. Hang in there. Oh, he, he barely lived. Whew. All right. Hire a Paladin. Ha! Okay, we're hi hire another Knight. Another Knight. we got to focus on Knights at the moment. And, um... Can do another Swordsman as well. End the year. Jeez. Go get him. Alright, Paladin doing work. He needs to heal his friends, though. Alright, we can do another pa Oh, shoot. It goes up in cost, too, huh? Oh, well. Let's do another Knight. Then we'll do... Man, I need to get some archers, I think. The swordsmen are not cutting it anymore. Okay. Lumber mill. Minus 20 gold for each peasant. Reallocates peasants. How many people go in the... 100 wood for that. So we would maybe want 5 peasants into the wood. Right? How do I reallocate them, though? I don't understand how that works. Okay, 400. So it, it takes them automatically, I suppose. 2,100 for that. Not enough faith, though. I gotta have faith, the faith, the faith. <laughs> Alright, let's get a few swordsmen on. Just to make sure we're gonna be safe. Yep. Oh, that's not too bad of a fight. Not too bad at all for me. Oh, the paladin is healing. Nice. Okay. So, let's see. Can hire another paladin. Beautiful. Okay, construct... Okay, we can make a um, shooting ground now. Cool. 200 for archers. That's 200 wood. Okay, we can afford... No, we don't need to make another one yet. I think a town hall would be important at this point to another town hall. 3,000 for that. Oh, gosh. We need more food, too, though. So let's build more forester huts. 800. Okay. Whoa, what are these guys? Minotaurs. Holy crap. All right, go. Oh boy, he's taking some serious damage there. Whew. Who did we lose? One knight. Alright, we gotta get some more knights in. Maybe another archer or two. He can't, he can't afford another one though. Okay. 400. Can't afford any more peasants. Looks like this year is up fight. Should be a winnable match. Yeah, the archers seem pretty useful. Another archer. We can also build another shooting ground. That takes 600 wood, though. We don't need any more wood production. Not quite enough for the next faith for the paladin. I'm not liking building the swordsman anymore. It doesn't feel right anymore. Something feels off about it. Okay, scouting. There's three minotaurs in this one. One unicorn. One tiger can stay in the army. What? What is that supposed to mean? Okay, let's... We'll wait for the paladin to get beefed up, you know? And, um... 
We'll hire plenty of swordsmen for the Minotaur fight. Not enough food. Another chicken farm. Plenty of swordsmen for this next fight. In the year. Perfect. So we've got a max army almost. We gotta build another chicken farm. Or actually we can build a hut, maybe. And then we can do this. Paladin. Oh, we can hire another knight too, huh? Shoot, not quite enough money though. Ah. Alright. Let's let's challenge the Minotaur man. No 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 no, we're not gonna do it. We're gonna wait for the next knight. The next knight is what we're gonna do. Okay, shooting round. We can hire some more archers if we build this. Next time though. We need chicken coops too. In the air. Attacker. Oh wow, that's a big army. My army's just as big though. Oh man, we wrecked them, man. We wrecked them. Oh, we lost one swordsman? I didn't think I lost anyone. Okay, got a knight. Got a swordsman. Now we're ready to challenge. Oh wait, we can do one archer. Build a chicken fire. Build a chicken fire. Okay. Let's go do this Minotaur lair. Army of Lair. All right, fight! Go, go! Oh, heal the other paladin! Oh my goodness. Well, at least we got it. Lost four swordsmen. Empty. It's empty now. So now we can progress beyond that, I suppose. I wonder what happens when you get so far along. Let's see. We need a uh, 45... Exorcist train taken from knights. What do exorcists do exactly is what I'm wondering. I'm not too sure. Alright. Okay, so I'm trying to plan this out. That would be more faith per year, but my paladins are doing alright. Hmm. I do need more paladins though. A lot more paladins. Druids. Bleh. Bleh to druids. I need guns, man. I need guns. <laughs> I'm American. Where's my gun? Alright. So we can build a... We got plenty of food, actually, at the moment. Doesn't hurt to have a little bit more 50 food. Or 50 gold. Alright, end of the year. Phyto! Do the archers just only shoot one time? What's going on with that? Exorcist joins the army. Your Minotaur's Hydra's usual will also lose half their life. I don't have any of those. That doesn't matter to me. Angel joins the army. Okay, yeah, we'll do that. Okay. Exorcist. Haha. <laughs> so we can have one exorcist. Or just, I guess it's just the one for now. What does this guy do exactly? He's 49 damage. Simultaneously attacks all adjacent enemies. So he's 9 damage. Knights are 9 damage. Okay, so I guess he does good damage to like a spread of people. And he's faith based as well. Courage 8. What is courage? I don't know what that means. Alright, so we need to... I think we need to up our gold production a little bit again. Um, so we need more peasants. So I'm going to hang off this time since we're pretty well stocked for our army. Alright, that worked. Another town hall. Hire some peasants this time around. Should add a lot of um, business to me. Alright, end of year. Oh, that's a huge army right there. Oh, my exorcist is dying! No, don't die! No! He died! Darn it. Lost two swordsmen, too. Darn. My exorcist was kind of low tier there. <laughs> Alright. 
Okay, I took a small quick break and I can't remember what I was doing. <laughs> I was on year 32. Um, knights, paladins, swordsmen, uh, peasants. What was I trying to build? Construction. Uh, not another town hall, right? Because I got plenty of peasants left over. I want some more... What do I want? I want some more knights, I think. But I also need more paladins. But paladins are basically the same thing as knights, right? Looks like it. Only heal humans and angels. Swordsmen, they're just kind of outdated. Some more archers would be nice too for the knights. 40 life, 40 life, 30 life. I don't know, maybe more swordsmen. They can be the front line for the paladins. So we'll pop on three more swordsmen. Construct a building. So let's see, Forester's Hut, no, 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 Cathedral, I'm thinking about the Exorcist, to be honest, Sky City, what are angels, what do angels do? Adds five to maximum life that paladins can heal, hmm, I guess that would be pretty important, I do have a lot of faith left too, so, I think it's time to build another... Now let's do a, do another church. Actually, monastery would be a little bit better, I think. Fifty faith. We got plenty of faith built up. Yeah, we need we need more paladins, so we're gonna let the gold build up a little bit. And then we'll see. Oh, here we go. Each uh, each unit killed unit can be resurrected with a fifty percent chance. Sounds good. That sounds very good. Divine Intervention, achievement unlocked. Another archer. We're going to have to build a um, chicken farm again. And we'll do a few more peasants again. I guess we'll have to do another chicken farm. And we can still get some more peasants. One, two. And then... I guess that's it. <laughs> I guess that's it. Okay, so this thing comes back to life and does 20 damage, 60 life? Wow. We're going to have to build towards angels. I'm convinced now. No fight. All right. So what do we got to do? Cathedral. We need a cathedral. Do we build more peasants or do we just keep rocking with it? Our army's looking pretty good. Let's look at the scouting report. Can we get their unicorn? I'm thinking about doing it. Let's try to do the unicorn. Uh, 14, knocks back. That's 60% chance. This should be easy. Fight. Oh yeah, that was super easy. One tiger can stay in the army. What is that supposed to even mean? Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. Alright. Um... So no more peasants. Let's just build it up. Build it up a little bit. In the air. Wow, that's a lot of stuff. Holy crap, man. Look at all those freaking people. Oh my gosh. This is going to be wild. Isn't it? I'm glad I got a lot of archers, but holy crap. Hopefully that 50% um, res pays off. Oh my gosh, I think we're going to lose this, dude. Oh my gosh, look at all this. Well, I might have lost the game now. Oh, more peasants come in. We do have a lot of peasants. Holy crap. Uh, I think this is game over. Defeat. You held out for 34 years. I like this game. I like it. I, w I would like to beat it. I'll probably beat it on my own time. Uh, but this has just been like a gameplay preview here, guys. Um, you know, if you ever decide to get the game yourself, it's it's something to look forward to beating it. And I think it looks like there's multiple branches. Maybe you can get different endings. I don't know. Um, either way, this was a surprising game. Uh, usually I see these small indie games I, I want to play or that I get a chance to play. And I don't always take the chance, but I'm glad I took the chance on this game. This has been a lot of fun. It's been a lot of fun. So uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed watching as much as I enjoyed playing it. It was fun. Good music. Um, nice variety. Nice play style. Nice 
nice overall. I like it. I like it. I think if they ever do like a sequel to this, like a hundred years or whatever, they could do a lot of work with this game and just build on this concept really well. It would be nice. It would be nice to see. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. I thank you guys again for watching. Hope to see you next time.